Black History Month honors our past, but it's also a time when we look to the future and the younger generation is leading the way. At just 14 years old, Kalia Love Jones is an inspiration, especially for those who dream of a career in filmmaking and animation. And her first animated short was inspired by a Michelle Obama speech. The main character was moved by the words of the former first lady and went on to pursue her dreams. I recently chatted with Kalia about the power of hope was brainstorming one day and when I was 12 and I came up with the idea for the film. And once I had that idea, I like went to my parents and um, throughout this whole journey, they've supported me. And I don't think I could have made it without the support of my family. And tell us about this character in the film. Uh, she's a young lady who loses her mother, but then she she goes on to pursue dreams of being an architect. Tell us about this character and that story. Um, yeah, The Power of Hope tells the story of a young girl who's striving to become an architect, but um, when her mother falls ill um, and she's faced with all these obstacles and they're like preventing her from reaching her goal, but through the power of hope, she's able to strive and reach that goal that she's been um, sh striving for. <laughs> How did you come up with that? Um, I guess I just wanted to write something that was, that could be like relatable, but also something like inspiring. I wanted to be, wanted it to be relatable so people could like understand and like feel a connection to the film. So when you were putting together The Power of Hope, how, how did it start? How were you able to make this become a reality? I love drawing. And um, I guess that's how, just how I put my, my ideas down on paper. Um, I had drawn, the, drawn out what I wanted to see first. I showed it to the crew, showed, it to, showed them what I wanted to see. And we all just worked together. The film was funded through um, money that I got from recycling over the years. Um, I've been recycling for years now, um, just like um, when I was in elementary school, I was work, I was helping out a custodian and he was putting all these, all the plastic bottles into a separate bag. And I asked him about it and he told me about how you could earn money from recycling. This is getting some Oscar buzz. This is getting some awards buzz. What's your reaction to that? Um, I never actually expected that um, when I started that the film would get this much attention and it's make, and it's really happy. I'm really happy. Yeah, I hope that people, when they see this film, they feel inspired um, the same way that Michelle Obama was um, an inspiration to me. So what's in the works for the future? What are you working on right now? What's next? Um, I, I hope I can continue working in film. I definitely want to continue working in um, animated films. And I hope I'll be able to make um, a TV show or a, um, a full length movie in the future. And you're based out of LA, which is really a, a great place to work on these things. And what are your goals, you know, for school, for, you know, reaching these goals? Um, I'm in my first year of high school right now. And I hope I'll continue to learn all about like filmmaking um, all throughout my high school years. And um, maybe I could go to a college like CalArts, which is pretty close by, or just in an, um, an art college. And you can just tell, I mean, she's on yes. her way. Yeah, she right. is on her way. First year of high school and already some Oscar buzz. That is amazing. So amazing. poised. Well, The Power of Hope will be screened at the 29th Annual Pan-African Film and Arts Festival virtually on February 28th through March 14th. Kalia also provides updates on The Power of Hope film on Instagram, so we have all that information on this story on ClickOrlando.com.